morning Livingston community. In accordance with our values and responsibilities to you and your children, I'd like to take this opportunity to communicate with you a matter that impacts our agricultural department. As you know, we run and compete with our stud Dorpa sheep throughout the year at numerous events. Many of our students from year seven to 12 are extensively involved in the care, training, and provide affection to our sheep. Our biosecurity measures are rigid and they're tested to ensure that there are no failings for the protection of both our students and our flock. There are, however, natural incidents, patterns, and oddities that can occur that are out of our control and our prevention. One of the foreseeable oddities that may crop up is that of Q fever. Q fever is a bacterial infection that can be acquired from dogs, cats, cattle, sheep, goats, native wildlife, etc. Animals with Q fever show no signs of the illness but shed the bacteria into the environment through bodily fluids. Animals cannot be vaccinated against Q fever. There's a readily available vaccination for people over the age of 15. It does require pre-vaccination screening and it takes 14 days for the waiting period of those results to come back. That's to ensure that natural immunity has not already been gained by the person. Due to the nature of our climate and our pasture, the risk of any transmission is low. There are numerous other management techniques that are employed on a daily basis to ensure the risk of Q fever transmission is minimal. Please contact me if you have any queries in this regard. There'll be two signs noting Q fever risk area going up on either side of the campus. There is no known Q fever infection recorded on Livingston Christian College's property. And as such, these signs are there merely to inform you of the possibility of Q fever's presence in the natural environment. If you have further questions, you can refer to the Queensland Government publication, Health and Safety Fact Sheet, Q fever in the school environment, Alternatively, please do not hesitate to contact me by email, that is troy.reynolds at livingston.qld.edu.au or just catch me on campus and I'll be happy to discuss this topic with you. Thanks.